I know Bolayo now. Bonner Boy is one of the most confused musicians that I'm trying to understand. I know Bolayo now. Bonner Boy is one of the most confused Nigerian musicians I'm trying to understand. I do not mean it as an insult. To, I'm not insulting him. But I just find it really confusing to understand. Okay. You guys know about Lil Dog. For me, I think Lil Dog deserves to go down. Yeah, because by now, every American gangster should have learned their lesson. I believe Lil Dog should go down. Now, we are here, we saw our own Odogu advocating. He said, free Lil Dog. Advocating for the freedom of Lil Dog. The same Odogu called Nigeria. I support Amo for this one. Oh. The same Bonaboy came to Nigeria, got someone arrested for insulting him, kept that person in jail for four good days. Now you are advocating for someone who hired somebody to end another person's life. Make it make sense. You, you are here. You came down to Nigeria. Got someone arrested. Got someone arrested. Went through the justice system. Did the proper thing. Went to the police. Wrote a petition against someone. Did the proper thing. You didn't carry no harms. You didn't go through the illegal, illegal means. You did the proper thing in your own country. Then you went to someone else's country to support someone who decided to take law into his hands. Make it make sense, Udugu. See, I'm going to advise the uh, Bonner boy. See, let me be honest with you. Eh? Do not get yourself a tangled into America gangster's life. You understand? You are enjoying all the stuff. The only people that can get themselves a tango are bloggers and all those people who just want to talk. But you, you are a superstar, a musician. You have a voice. Do not get yourself a tango into their own issues. Because someone died. And those, that person, their own family, they are looking for revenge. So do not get yourself a tangled into their own matter because they do not play by the rules anymore. Before, no snitching. Before, there are some rules they do not break. But over there, they do not play by the rules anymore. They can decide to go after you for supporting rubbish. For supporting someone who handed their own family member's life. So be careful, Bonner boy. Enjoy. Enjoy the fame. Because when it affects you, it affects everybody in Nigeria. Because you are, you are our own. Despite you are trying to remove yourself as part of our own, we still recognize you as our own. Do not just go around posting rubbish. When you will come to your own country and do the right thing, then you go outside to support somebody who is not doing the right thing. Who the hell are you bringing into this whole big music business? Face your music now. <laughs> One man when they claim fella, 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 no they call police, so. Fella say if you hate police. The same man when they run up and down with black Americans. When they look at from little way to Snoop Dogg to 50 Cent, nobody they call police for issue. But he they call police for small joke. Ta! You don't give me green, I go open stop for you yet. It's a free smoke. Come on, man. That is the nickname of a uh, uh, little dog. Little dog deserve whatever he's getting. I want to say this: if you have mind to hand to commit crime, then you should also have mind to pay for the crime. Why are you running? Why are you running? Anybody that can decide to hand someone's life. Because of mere beef. That person is a real devil. This is the guy who sings all my life. Inspirational song.
just for you to be one of the most devilish person on earth. Well, if you are guilty, I pray you pay, you, go, you get the ultimate price. But if you are not, sorry, I pray you get freed as well. But I don't think so. Because your action recently proved that you are guilty. When this guy knew that FBI was on his tail, you know what this guy did? According to report, they said he booked multiple flights. He booked a flight to Italy, booked a flight to Dubai, and booked a flight to another country. At the same time, to confuse the FBI. Like, FBI was like slightly confused. Like, this guy booked three flights at the same time. Where is he actually going to? They were confused as to where Liu Dog was going to. Because Liu Dog knew. So he was trying to manipulate. You don't manipulate the system. You can only dodge for a while. But you can't. Finally, they got him. This guy is done. Somebody that doesn't appreciate the success. Want to ruin his life. And you people are saying free Liu Dog. When he already wanted to ruin his life. Come on, man. To hell with that. I pray he get the ultimate prize if he's guilty. Bonner boy should just stay away from that issue. Don't, don't get people angry abroad and you know you are a superstar from Nigeria. They will decide to teach you a lesson because you do not know much about them. You just come from Nigeria and you are safe free somebody. Who are you? Somebody can just decide to pick your matter. <laughs> yeah, so somebody over there can just decide to pick your matter. Okay, my brother got killed and you are saying free this guy, B. No worry. I will show you Pepe. You think say uh, America and uh, UK. You think say America and uh, uh, Nigeria. America, they get their own AK guns. UK and uh, knives that they use, they don't get. Don't just go there and entangle yourself with stupid stuff. Oh. Better remove your mouth and face your music, face your business before they go deal with you. You arrested the uh, speed dalit in here. You go to the support person, may not do the right thing over there. Move past that. I want to ask this question. Why is it that? Why is it eh, that a lot of followers, eh, a lot of citizens of many countries, USA, Nigeria, and so many other countries, why is it that it's important that a celebrity support a candidate? Why is it that there's an influence on a celebrity supporting a candidate that comes around to influence you on who and how you should vote. Why? I'm still trying to understand it. Why? Why? Why does a celebrity need to support for, he, for, that, for, for you to be influenced to vote for that person? Beyonce and uh, Kelly Rowland, I respect them a lot. We uh, recently uh, supported uh, Kamala Harrison. We saw that celebrity supporting Donald Trump. And over here again, we see many celebrities supporting some political uh, officers, politicians. And because of that alone, you guys will rally around and be supporting that politician. In fact, a celebrity supporting any politician should be a number one, number one barrier for you not to vote for that candidate. How many celebrities are going through what you are going through? Let's be honest. How many of them? No. How many are actually like going through exactly what you are going through that you will need a celebrity to influence you to vote for someone that you do not even know in his background you don't even have more trust on all those celebrities do not go through what you go through they have everything with them how can you i don't understand the 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 idea behind it most especially i'm i'm particularly worried about my own country i don't understand the idea at all why do they influence you? Then we saw Dino Milai. He leave Nigeria politics. Can't they go abroad? He said, 
If Elon Musk will not stop harassing Kamala Harrison, I will sell my Tesla and advise my friends to do the same. America should not lose her pride as a global democratic police. Senator Dino Melai. <laughs> ah, you make me laugh, but let me just forget about that. Let's talk about Nigeria. Yesterday was Friday, and uh, you know, the uh, president was uh, went to Mox. One of the most surprising sites was uh, okay, Atiku was also there. Atiku uh, came to Mox as well, and Atiku stood up to greet the president. Why won't Atiku stand up to greet the president? We are talking about the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. No matter the political differences, eh, as long as you are a politician, you should accord that respect to president. The only person that I feel like will never accord such respect to president, who is not a politician anyway, is Asha Yusufu. <laughs> I know Asha Yusufu will see the president and not stand up to greet the president. It's understandable. But why are you guys mocking Atiku and others, opposition, for standing up to greet Bola Ahmed Tunubu, the president of Nigeria of the Federal Republic of Cruz Nation? Why? Why? It's normal now. It's normal. Political differences. But I will accord you that respect. The surprising one is Akpabio that was there. I never knew Akpabio was a Muslim. So you mean we have... Uh, you mean we have a, a president that is a Muslim? A vice president that is a Muslim? A senate president that is a Muslim? A house of rep? Okay, the house of rep uh, president is a Christian, is an Igbo man. So you mean we have three Muslims? Bolame Tunubu, Kasim Shetima, and Akpabio, goes with Akpabio. Ah, I never knew we have three Muslims who adopt. Because what is goes with Akpabio doing the box? <laughs> ah, politics, eh? Oh, as a politician, if you use your heart to play politics, eh? You know, go ever favor you. In Ninja, let's be honest. That is why you go hard for 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 some people to be politicians. Peter Obi is, le is learning the game very, very, very well. And I pray that game, eh? I pray that game may benefit him. Because we are seeing countlessly in mocks, eating with Muslims. Ah, that is really great to show unity. I pray the games reward him in the long run. Hmm? <laughs> Don't take politics serious, my brothers and sisters. These guys are just flexing, relaxing themselves, enjoying themselves. They no even get mind for any fight we did themselves. But outside on the news, they go type, right? But when they see each other, they accord respect to each other. So that alone should tell you why are you fighting yourself instead of you to reunite yourself. To have much of the power to yourself. I don't understand. Hmm?